going to be showing you all how to get um, a skin on a Minecraft intro template. Now, on some intro templates, the skin is all, it's either the old skin, which is this. The old skins look like this. Now, if you zoom in here, this is the skin here. It looks like this. It's just a rectangle and all the, all the pieces to the character are here. For the new version skins, this is what the new version skins look like. The new version skins are sort of shaped like a square, and the, instead of the legs being right here, right here, next to the body, the and they're like here, and your designs are like at the bottom. So, for the intro template that I'm going to be using right now, it's going to be the newer version. So, this is how I'm going to show you how to put the skins in. Now, this one is one that um, I went into a on YouTube and found this, and a whole bunch of people were like, Oh, I'm G, how the hell do you change the skin on this junk? Well, anyway, I'm going to show you. Okay, so first when you come to the template, you're, it's not going to look like this because, um, it's not going to look like this because, uh, yeah, I changed it up. I set it to the way I desire, so you can do the same. So now I'm going to show you how to actually change the skin. Now, if we just uh, render view this in rendered mode right here, as you can see, there is no skin on this character. It's just purple. Well, for you, it shouldn't be purple. For me, it's like that because I took out the default skin that it came with. So to add your own skin, what you're going to do is, if it's the newer version, you're fine and you have the skin downloaded. You have to have it like the skin that you want downloaded. If it's an uh, older skin, what um, you're going to do is, um, this is what I go to. And uh, so here, basically what you can do is you can edit your skin to ha either have the, for like the template to either be the new version or the old version. Now, okay, okay, so... Now, um, this is gonna take a while to load. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna press save when you finish when you type in your name and skin and everything. If it wants to work, I mean I'm outside right now, guys. Yeah, I'm all like um, outside just because why not? Why not record outside? And uh, so yeah. So anyway, what you do is you save it, and then it will have this. To get the old version skins, you come here, and then you just download the skin and whatever and whatnot. So yeah, um, that's basically all you do. So now what you're going to do to actually change the skin is you're going to come over to the character and you're going to try to right click. Now sometimes you get these parts, these little line parts, you don't want to get that. You actually want to get the outlined head. Do you see how I have it? You want to actually get the outlined head. I usually click the head, it doesn't really matter. Then what you're going to do is most people go to UV editing here, you don't do that. You go over here to the top right corner and click on materials. And now you'll see three options here. You're going to click the first one. And then you, it should say file name here. You're going to press the X, which is over here, and then it will say open. Now what you're going to do is you're going to press open, and you're going to get your skin. But not if you get the old version skins, this is what how it's going to look like. Then when I render it, it looks insane. So you cannot use the old version skins on um, in this template. So you have to use the new ones. So here I'm going to show you. You're going to get your skin here I believe this one is it yes this is it. it is and then when we render it boom there you go and I'll let you it'll let it finish rendering just to show that it renders properly you see there's my skin hold on lag okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna zoom into the face to make sure that it is um the right one so here you go so there you go, the skin is now on your, in this template, that is how you put the skins on. Um, and one more thing that you want to do before you actually render it and everything, this is what you want to do. When you have all your skins set up to the right thing, what you want to do is up here, the top right, press reload trusted and press revert. I don't know what this does, but in one of the other templates that I was using, um, one the head was on backwards, and when you press that, it actually fixed the head, so just to make sure... None of the body parts are on backwards or anything. You just want to click that. And then um, when you render it, yeah, it should have your skin on it. Same for the other character over here. Anyway, guys, this is the Mario from the Fiends 47 here. And uh, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. If you like this video, hit the like button, please. And uh, yeah, see you all in the next video. Bye-bye, guys. Where the fuck is he? Where is he? Right here.